All right, on this episode of Bouts Talking Bouts, excited to be talking to an individual fighting at PFL Challenger Series 10, which goes down on February the 3rd. An intriguing featherweight fight with Senna van der Veerdonk taking on Carolina Sobek, and happy to be welcoming Carolina on the show. How's your day going so far, Carolina? Uh, Delon, can you repeat? I don't hear you, but really. Oh, I was just wondering how Carolina's day was going so far. Ah, oh, so Karina said that uh, today morning we make uh, MMA drills. Uh, after that, it was uh, pad work. Yes, or we train a little bit stand up also. And now uh, we, we wait for for the training uh, for Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, and uh, I feel great. Yeah, that's awesome, and just you know what a great opportunity like i feel like pfl's you know women's featherweight division is relatively newer and now there's a chance to you know punch a ticket to getting into the pfl season like what were carolina's thoughts and feelings when this fight offer first came her way no no, but I think that the Santa Cochante is a little bit of a contract to the Gurna Tunie. No, I think that the Santa Cochante is a little bit of a contract to the Santa Cochante. No, I think because it's a, a big federation uh, and she wants to fight with the, the best of the world. And also, Karina said that she wants the contract for the tournament. So that's all, and we, we show it on the 3rd of February. Yeah, for sure. And just, yeah, a great opportunity and everything like that. I feel like PFL had mostly been doing the women's lightweight fights before. So good to see the development there and everything but you know just kind of curious like the thoughts on the upcoming opponent here like it seems like they're an experienced judoka like have you been checking out tape on previous fights of Senna van der Veerdonk? <laughs> Yeah, and you guys are kind of similar, at least in the context of both having three submission finishes in MMA. And with this, you know, Challenger Series having a judging panel where the most standout performance gets that PFL contract. Like, does Carolina feel like 
her fight style blends itself well to something like this, like a judging panel where if you get an exciting finish, it betters your chances at, you know, securing that PFL contract. No, zawsze jest tak zdarza, że bardzo rzeczy tak zdarza, że jak twoje zawodnicy gra w ramach, to walka toga się dobrze się w tłupę. Nie, myślę, że tak przewiduję, że, że może wyjść tak, że tak naprawdę ta walka się nie będzie dotyczyła w parterze, tylko, tylko będzie w walce w tłupę. No ale myślę, że myślę, że jestem najlepszym draperem moja rywalka, więc nawet jeżeli dojdziemy do parteru, to, to myślę, że nie obawiam się go, czy będę z góry, czy będę z dołu. So Karolina said that uh, when when in the octagon meets uh, two fighters, uh, they are grapp grapplers, yes, like Karolina and Tina. Uh, most of the fights is in stand up, and, and but for Karolina it doesn't matter. Uh, it doesn't matter that we fight in in, in, uh, in, the, in the round, yes. Uh, because this is an MMA fight, uh, yes, the same like I said before, we will see on February what happens. And I imagine Carolina is, you know, super focused on her own fight, but just like I said, it's kind of like a, you know, judging panel based sort of thing. So I'm wondering if she has even like any kind of peripheral, like outside awareness of any of the other featherweight fights that are going on on this Challenger Series card. Like, has she checked out any of the other fighters on this event? Zawodniczkę, która trenuje z Kyle Harrison. Więc widziałam ją, to z czasem się gdzieś tam w mediach na, na, na Instagramie przyjmiała, ale tak naprawdę nie sprawdzałam innych rywalek. Nie, nie oglądałam ich walk, tyle co tam e, gdzieś w mediach e, je widziałam, ale nie, 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 nie oglądałam ich walk. So Karolina said that the truth is that she don't check anybody. Only she know, uh, she know one fighter from that, she, from not from that, from probably American top team, because she trained with Kyla Harrison. But the truth is that uh, we don't check anybody also, Karolina. And something else I'm just kind of curious about, because I was noticing that Carolina participated in bare knuckle mixed martial arts. I'm really curious as to, you know, what her overall experience is with that were. Like, she didn't necessarily get the ideal outcome per se, but how did she feel just competing in bare knuckle MMA? Bardzo fajnie, była to fajna przygoda. Myślę, że jeszcze kiedyś jak będzie taka okazja wezmę udział w takiej walce. Wtedy była, była to fajna okazja, bo była to pierwsza walka kobiet w Polsce w moim kraju na gołe pięści, więc cieszę się, że to ja wiem miałam w niej udział I, i, i myślę, że na pewno kiedyś, jak na razie jest to dużo ryzyko przy mojej karierze mam, ale myślę, że kiedyś, jeżeli będzie taka okazja, za parę lat jak najbardziej będę chciała się znowu zmierzyć, bo podoba mi się ta formuła, bo jest bardzo brutalna i taka ciekawa dla, dla oka, dla kibica. So Barnoka was for Carolina uh, a very big adventure and she said that maybe in the future Uh, when she, when someone gives Karolina uh, an opportunity to fight in bare knuckles, she will make it because, as I say, it's a very uh, big adventure, and she likes it. She likes it, but now it's uh, the risk. The risk is too much for for that fight because Karolina is focused on MMA career. And I noticed that opponent that you faced in bare knuckle MMA, you ultimately you secured a victory over them via submission and gloved mixed martial arts. Was that an especially important win? Like, did it feel redemptive or did it not really feel that way? Because it's like a different sport being that there was gloves involved with that one. Mm-hmm. 
Tak naprawdę no, jest to dość, 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 dość podobne sporty. Ta, tam formuła tak naprawdę była, można powiedzieć, MMA po prostu, tylko, mm, tylko bez rękawic. E, w, no, myślę, że po prostu dzięki tym gołym pięściom ta, te uszkodzenia są większe, te obrażenia zawodników, zawodników którzy walczą są większe i, i, i to jest taka znacząca różnica. Też e, do, ba, bardzo dużo te ręce są narażone na jakieś złamania. Więc, więc to jest też dużo bardziej niebezpieczna formuła, ale, ale myślę, że głównym jest takim tym, że ta, ta, ta pięścia jest ręka jest goła i, 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 i też od to większą krzywdę. So, Karolina said that uh, the fight in Bernaka was also like in MMA. Uh, the difference was only without gloves, but uh, the fight in Bernaka, when you make a MMA fight without gloves, uh, it's much more difficult because uh, the bones Uh, you, are, you have a bone fight and you can make a lot of injuries. You can make it or somebody also make you the injuries. So it's a big danger when you fight without gloves and a bare knuckle. But as, a, as Karolina say, that was an MMA fight. Yeah, for sure. I just thought it was interesting. It was the same opponent across the two different sports there, both bare knuckle and gloved. MMA, but I do want to be mindful of, you know, Carolina's time and the rest of her schedule. I don't want to go too far over the allotted interview time. So to that point, is there anything she might want to add as like a final parting thought as we're wrapping up? Hey, Dylan, now I don't understand you. Sorry, but it's for me, your, your English is very difficult. So I know I'm, I, I don't understand what you, what you want to ask now. Oh, no worries. Just if there's a parting thought, like if, if maybe something hasn't been mentioned in the interview, just kind of giving her the floor if there's anything she might want to, you know, mention or shout out, I suppose. I don't understand the one. Sorry. Oh, that's okay. I mean, yeah, I'm just excited for this fight. Should be a good one against Senna van der Veer Donk, and I appreciate both of you making time ahead of this fight on February 3rd. So, yeah, both of you have a good rest of your day. Thank you very much. You also. Bye, my friend. Bye. Bye.